and welcome to the very first edition of Point of View. I'm Tanya Nugent and on this program we'll be sharing our thoughts and experiences, celebrating achievements, having a look at what's been going on in the world and trying to explore some of the issues that matter to women. And it's my pleasure to introduce to you on set today my panellist Miss Filma Kelligai who is the founder of the Leniata Legacy, owner of World Supermodel PNG, and an advocate against gender-based violence. Philly, welcome. Also with us today, Ms. Cleopatra Coulter, writer, radio announcer, and entrepreneur. And our very special guest today is Ms. Nonna Deer from the Business Coalition for Women. Welcome, Nonna. Welcome, ladies. Well, we are thrilled today to be launching this new platform for women's voices regularly here on MTV, and we're especially thrilled to be launching it on International Women's Day. This year, the theme for International Women's Day 2017 is to be bold for change. But before we talk about what we need to be bold to change, let's talk about what we have to celebrate, ladies. And happy International Women's Day, Philly. What do we have to celebrate? Happy International Women's Day, Tanya. We have a lot to celebrate um, as a country. Um, globally, we've come a long way as well. In, in the 1970s, in the developed world, women were not allowed to have a credit card without their husband's signature. So I'm really glad that we have the financial independence, greater financial independence. Uh, we can make our own money, we can make our own decisions, and I'm excited about that. Mm. Just adding on to that globally and internationally, I think the self-worth of women, Tanya, it's just come a really long way where we have, we're actually realizing our value and actually um, being more empowered to that effect. So that attitude in itself is just enormously great. Mm. Yeah. And also our traditional <coughs> roles have changed. Um, women are now being empowered and we see you know, women having access to basic information that could save their lives from health to education. Yeah. Well, as I mentioned earlier, the theme for 2017 International Women's Day is Be Bold for Change. So clearly we do have uh, some things that uh, need to improve on. What are some things, Philly, or one thing that you would like to see change for our women? Well, definitely I'd like to see women have better access to things that they need. For example, justice is a huge issue for me. I'd like to see more women uh, understand what kind of help they, they can get, who they need to go to, and to be provided with that information and be empowered mm. to get the help they need. Yeah. Yeah. yeah absolutely. Um, I'd like to basically see more women in leadership roles in this country because I believe that more women in leadership um, actually brings, a, brings with it a great deal of development. Um, I'd like to see the obstacles that actually hinder women um, going into those senior roles actually um, brought down in that we can actually support the women in the private public sector where, wherever it is um, rise in their careers. Yeah. yeah, fantastic. We'll probably talk about that a little bit more later in the program. Claire, what about you? I think one of the greatest challenges for Papua New Guinea especially is um, access to basic health services. Um, oh. The World Health Organization has reported that 3,000 women die annually of cervical cancer alone in PNG and that is you know, a big number to lo lose every year. So I think the, the, you know, the, the challenge is there that we need to address. Yeah. Well, I, I sort of, yeah, I, I, my thing is justice as well. Mm -hmm. I think that I would like to see, um, you know, this, it's no secret that, you know, sometimes I feel like women in our country are quite frankly under attack, you know, mm -hmm. and we rarely see justice. Yeah. Um, all of us have been touched by you know, incidents where we feel like we need justice served. And um, yeah, so we do have a, lot of, a long way to go. We have a lot to celebrate and we have a long way to go. We're going to take a very quick break now. And when we return after the break, we'll be talking about how the status of women in Papua New Guinea has evolved from traditional times to now. We'll be right back.